Welcome fellow gamers to this legendary journey into the depths of Unreal Tournament 99's System Folder. Today we are diving deep into the mysterious world of the setup exe file, the disobedient or self-willed inner system file of this classic game. In fact, this video tutorial is so unreliable that I can only guarantee that we will get the setup exe file to launch, but that doesn't mean it will work. It doesn't work properly for me, but maybe it will work for you. You probably encountered the dreaded critical error message, yeah? Fear not, my friend, for we are about to embark on a quest to make that setup exe file shine like it's 99. And if you are not getting the error message, well, consider yourself lucky. Or you know, tell us what makes it work. Now being the Windows virtuoso that I am, let's navigate through the labyrinth of folders listed in the error message. If you are not using Windows 10, don't panic. Just pray your operation system is somewhat comparable. So, here we are in the mystical realm of your Windows user folder. Copy the rest of the path from my doobly-doo and paste it into the address bar. If you are feeling rebellious, you can navigate the old-fashioned way by revealing hidden folders using the features in the View tab. Now, in your Unreal Tournament System folder, grab and toss in these sacred files. Core DLL, Core Int, Manifest Ini, Setup Exe, Setup Int, Window DLL, Window Int. And don't forget about the logo BMP from the Help folder. You are basically assembling an Unreal Tournament clan of files right here. Open Manifest Ini with a notepad or something similar and add this ancient and secret code from the doobly-doo. Replace the star username star with your own username. Now brace yourself for the moment of truth. Launch the setup exe file and cross your fingers. But don't get your hopes too high. The setup exe file has a mind of its own. It's like dealing with a moody teenager. You never know what it's going to uninstall or install correctly. So I'm going to bravely attempt to uninstall the assault bonus pack. Watch closely as the setup exe works, it's not so magic, see? It claims to uninstall. It's not doing anything actually. And the grand finale. Installing UMODs. Prepare to be amazed as it proudly presents the UMOD with the enchanting name of the local product. Who needs specific names, right? Remember, this is the wild west of gaming tutorials, no guarantees. So buckle up, keep those fingers crossed and uh, let's the adventure begin. Subscribe for more wild gaming escapades and let's see where this crazy journey takes us. Happy gaming!